So before we get started with the unboxing today, I want to take a minute and wish April, my sister, a very, very happy birthday. Um, we have been through a lot together and I really appreciate and love you, April, for everything that you do for me and everything that you do for Pallet Jack and, and the community. Um, hope you have a beautiful, awesome day. And uh, also, Ella, um, save here first. I put her link down in the first uh, comment and also in the description, so you can check her out. But Ella, happy birthday to you as well. I love you, I appreciate all the love and support and everything that you've given uh, me in April. So I have a little message for you I wanna share. April and Ella, Anthony Anderson here. I'm here for one thing and one thing only. And that's to wish you both a happy birthday. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, April and Ella. From TJ. He wants you to know that he loves you both. So Anthony was so kind as to make that little sweet uh, message for you all. So let's get into the unboxing. Welcome to a Pallet Jacket unboxing. Is it really an unboxing? I don't know. I, we're supposed to be Ben time. Okay, it's Ben. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I don't. Whatever. What is up, beautiful people? TJ and April here with another episode of Pallet Jacket Ben time. Is something. that what we called it? I don't know. I can't remember. It's, it's something to do with the bins. This is kind of an unboxing because we're it's a it's a bin store reveal. It's a reveal. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I traveled to four bin stores on three different days, I think that would've was. I went last weekend um, to Gimme Five in Dalton, Georgia. Mm -hmm. And then I went up the road a little bit to North Georgia Liquidation. And I hit their bin store up. And then? I tried to get a pallet, couldn't do it. And then. <laughs> <laughs> didn't work out. Then a whole, fast forward a whole week. We didn't show y'all this stuff. We just hoarded it a little bit. Right. Even though I listed the stuff I got last week. And we actually sold some stuff. Yeah. Uh, so actually some of the stuff is not in this. I didn't thought about that. Either. Yeah. We'll figure that out yeah. when we get down to the end. Um, fast forward to this week, I went to the new bin store, which is Treasure Bins uh, on Amnicola Highway. It's not. It's, it's, what is it called? Is that what it's called? I think it's called Treasure Bin, Captain Bin. Captain Bin. <laughs> it's on Amnicola. It's on Amnicola. We went there in Chattanooga. And then I rounded it off with our go to, which is Lakeside Treasure Hunt. And I think I got some pretty good deals. I mean, if you watched the video yesterday, I talked a little bit about you know, what not to pick while you're at the band store. Some of these items are some of those what not to picks. Cause some, when you're in the band store, you kind of feel like you're you obligated to something. walk out with something. Yeah. So I actually got a couple personal items. Um, like I got some cords and uh, I think I got like an extension cord with like a bunch of USB ports in it oh, and okay. stuff like that. Stuff like that, you know, stuff that you buy personally yeah. for yourself. Get it because it's cheaper. Right. Why would you not get it? Right. It's, it's, it's five dollars or three dollars or <laughs> whatever day it is. Yeah. So. Uh, so I think we have a total of 31 items here. I think there's 32 items though because we sold one thing. We sold two things. So 33. Yeah, it's 30, 33 items, and we'll we'll tell the, those two things mm -hmm. uh, somewhere in the midst of this. Uh, so I'm not gonna tell you where we got the stuff from like individually. We're yeah, just gonna because, go through it because right. it'll take forever for me right. to remember that. And you'd be like, oh yeah, I got this from my <laughs> whatever. One more thing before we get started. If y'all like this video, please hit that like button before we get started. It really helps the channel out. Go ahead and do it because you'll get to the end of the video and you'll forget and click off. So go ahead and just hit the like button. Okay, I'm gonna so wait. Okay, it. All right, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> um, also, if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button because we do have unboxes, uh, unboxings every single week. And also we do some vlogs and just some super fun stuff. So y'all want to make sure y'all check that out. Right. All right, so let's get to the first item. And we priced everything before we did this. I know, so we did good. Most of the time, most of it I had already listed, so it wasn't that bad. <laughs> so this is a Moby Close Enough to Kiss um, Moby Wrap. It's like a baby. It's a baby uh, wrap. Yeah, it's like a baby wrap where you put the baby on your your chest right here. So right. I can know where I got most of the stuff from. So if I know where I got it from, I'll yeah. go ahead and tell you. I actually got this from Gimme Five. It was super busy. I bet. There, it was a lot of people there. They had a lot of product. Um, so I actually, if you are in the area, you want to check out Gimme Five, I would. 
um, because they do have a lot of good stuff. So this we have priced uh, for $25. I think that we'll be able to get $25 for this all day long. They're, they sell these at Target for about $40. Oh, really? Dollars, so that's why I said around $25 okay. after shipping and fees. Okay. Next we have, I don't know, I just pick up the most obscure. <laughs> we have this. It's a DMX512 decoder. I don't know what that means. I don't either. I have no idea what that means. <laughs> this is what it looks like. If y'all can see it. So normally I wouldn't pick up anything like this because... <laughs> It's, it's just, not in the package. It's literally just random. But when I looked it up, I found some soul comps for it. And yeah. the soul comps was pretty good. I think it was $70 yep. or $60. 60 or $70 is what I, when I just looked at it. Yep. And the ones that I've seen that soul actually didn't have a box. So maybe it just doesn't come with the box. I don't know. Yeah. Um, it's, it's just a Chinese kind of made thing. So It's just there randomly. All right. This is our next item. Um, this is a Zoomed Tropical UVB Heat and Lighting Kit. So this is for like a lizard or in like a terrarium okay. or whatever. And we actually sold one of those. Yeah, we, we sold two. one of these already. We had, I picked up two of these because I saw the sold comps. They were selling very fast. Um, so I got the only two that they had. And mm -hmm. these were both brand new, sealed, and they had a barcode. When you see those, love, when that trifecta comes yeah, around. Yeah, love barcodes. <laughs> I mean, because they're easy to scan. Yep. And you can scan and like, determine like really quickly if it's something you need to pick up or not. Yep. So we sold ours. We took an offer for for $30 plus shipping. But I think we had a list for $30. And then we had, we had marked down sales and stuff. 30 um, I think it was 30 <laughs> So you said we took... We, you said we uh, took an offer for 30. I think we had a list for 30. I think we had a list for 35. Okay. I think we had I'm, a, like, I'm sorry. Y'all know it's late in the afternoon. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> I just got off the phone with uh, Joe from Family Flips and I told him, yeah, me and April about to film an unboxing. It's going to suck the life out of me. I, know. <laughs> I can tell you exactly what we, if I can find it. It was $30 because I just filmed it last night. Okay. The, um, it was it was $30.18 plus shipping. Okay. So, um, But we had it listed for more than that, but we had, we were on markdown sales on our eBay store. Mm -hmm. um, speaking of, if you want to pick up anything from our eBay store, um, we do have a website you can go check out. It's www.palletjacking.com. Uh, it has the latest videos. Um, we also have our t-shirts, not this shirt, but our yeah. pallet jacking shirts that we don't have on this video. Right. Um, but we got a bunch of them. If you want to check those out, they are on the website. Also, uh, I'm going to update our uh, store at least two times a week. So if you go on palletjacking.com, it should have some of the newer items that we have listed because um, it just basically pulls the stuff over from eBay. If you see a price and you want to like negotiate on the price, shoot me a message or yeah. a message and we'll, you know, we'll we can finagle the prices yeah. and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, that was a lot okay. of words. <laughs> he had so much stuff to say. All right, so we're going to pull this out. Another mm -hmm. obscure box. This is a part number. 0623900057 encoder. I don't know what that means. I don't know what it encodes. So what that is, after I did some research, so when I saw it, it looked like kind of an old box, but the inside of it looked like it was brand new. This, this um, is and what I found was it's actually- I'm gonna tear it up. Yeah, it's got a six girl in there. Those actually wasn't on there when I got on that. Oh, okay. I just put on there to make sure they go. Um, but that's actually for a conveyor belt. So this is something that a manufacturing company or yeah. uh, a place that has a warehouse would actually want to purchase for- $120. That's what I'm talking about. Right. Uh, and I picked that up actually from North Georgia Liquidation. So you can kind of get some obscure kind of things at North Georgia Liquidation. Yeah. Never get like a lot of electronic type stuff that, no. from what I saw. Mm -hmm. And I wasn't there, as, I was there as soon as they opened. But, but I wasn't in line because it was raining. There? Okay. Were you there on restock day? It was on restock day. Okay. Yeah, it was Friday. Okay. Um, this is the next item. This is a starry projector light. Um, so this is like one of those lights, like galaxy lights. You can put it up and it shows, it shows the, the stars dark, and stuff. Yeah. Um, I haven't tested this yet. It looked like it was new. Uh, it does have a little bit of box damage. So I may test this out and see if it works. Make sure that it works. But, mm -hmm. um, I, I wrote it on there somewhere. I told you it'd be so obscure. I see it. <laughs> uh, so this right here is going for about $36. They have some that's higher priced, mm -hmm. some that's lower priced. Uh, but this one we just kind of priced around $30, the $36 mark yeah. because I think we'll be able to sell it pretty quickly for that amount. All right. Here's our next item is a Swimways My First Splash. It's like a little float for your baby. We had some of these actually. And they flew out. Do you remember they how did. fast they sold? Yeah. We, we got a those from a um, Target. It was a it was Target, Target palette, mm-hmm. And we, they was case packed, so it was all brand new, but them things was like. They was gone. 
So when I saw that, I picked it up quick. Yeah, so <laughs> uh, this is selling, so this is selling, I think on eBay for 20. Okay. Uh, that was the last old comp. Okay. So, I so I'm, I'm thinking probably as it get closer, like warmer time, we'll probably be able to get closer to like a resale because it's brand new. So yeah. we should be able to get closer to like a resale yeah. uh, type of price for that. Yeah. So next item, y'all. Next. Okay, this is a brown box. It is. And I have not opened it. Nope. Maybe it's I need a light. to open it. It is a light. Let it's me a, open it real quick. It's a, uh, what is it? It is a picture light. Yeah, there you go. I wrote it on there. I knew it is. So I normally, if you get brown boxes like this, um, the bin store that we go to, they have a lot of Home Depot stuff. One of them, um, if you see this yellow sticker on the side, that's normally a Home Depot item. I love Home Depot. I do too. It's it's like getting a Home Depot pallet without yeah. having to get all the junk. Yeah. You know, you can just pick out all the good yeah, stuff. Pick. Um, so I'm like great for that. So. Package on. Oh yeah, this is brand new. Yeah. Look at that. So this Ooh, is. The barcode on, on the back of. On the back of. This is a right light, uh, wireless LED picture light. Ooh, okay. So it actually goes over a picture. It's brand new. It's sealed. You can't get no better than this. Right. And we gonna keep it in this box and we mm -hmm. ship it right. We gonna ship it right on we'll just put, like this. Yeah, got we'll bubble wrap in it. I'm telling and you. And everything. This is like a perfect package. Yeah. Um, this is a hard box too. This ain't like our old cheap boxes that we got. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so this is going for about twenty seven dollars. Um, and we probably can finagle shipping. So we probably yeah. twenty seven dollars plus shipping for it. Yeah, I'll put um, shipping on everything. But yeah, this is a good pickup. Brand new. I didn't. I figured it was brand new because the box was un. It was taped up. It mm -hmm. wasn't like they retaped it. It was actually no. They just on. like resent it back or mm -hmm. whatever. But I was gonna say, make a statement <laughs> about. I can always tell who listed something when something sell on eBay if it has shipping or not. Yeah. Because. I always put shipping on everything. I've been putting shipping yeah. on quite yeah, because people pay shipping. They do. I mean, That's why I just put it on there. Yeah, especially if you're gonna if you're gonna accept offers, yeah. I would definitely tell you to um put to shipping. put shipping on it because you can accept the offer plus the shipping. Yeah. You know, you don't have to incorporate that into your, your pricing model. Yeah. So I, I mean I do it and I said, or at least pay half a shipping. So if you think it's gonna cost, you know, seven dollars, charge three dollars for yeah. shipping. You know? Yeah, and we our shipping is not calculated. I will not recommend doing calculated no. shipping. Some do people flat. do calculated shipping. I do flat. Yeah, well I if I look at the item, you know, I look at this and I know there's probably gonna be about seven dollars. Seven, seven, maybe the Ten. most twelve yeah. uh to send. So, you know, I will put like six ninety nine shipping on this. Yeah. You know what I mean? And even if I want to do free shipping, I would just kinda incorporate that into the price and know mm -hmm. how much I would get out of this. Um, after that. Look, we throwing all kind of nuggets out on this video. All right, next item. We have a um, bag localian. That's some kind of cycling bag or something. There you go. That's what it looked like. So it's like a little book bag. Yeah. I, mean, I guess it's like for hiking or something, maybe. It's brand new. It's brand, it is brand new, so they got the tags and whatnot on it. Um, it's $25 on eBay, okay. which that was the only one. I, and when I say this, it's like a really quick search. So it could be more. I doubt it's less because I think the cheapest one I saw was 25. I saw one for like 40. Okay. So I just went with 25 for right now. Okay. I'm gonna throw it on the floor right there. Let's get the next item. That wasn't a good accent. Was I don't it? know what that <laughs> is. Uh, this is a Aokok a uh, K. What is it called? <laughs> Aokok uh, K cup coffee maker. Um, it's just like a coffee maker. Yeah. K cup. Um, I put on here uh, forty dollars. They had a lot of these in the bins. April, really? there was a lot. Really? I mean, I bet you it was forty of them in the bins. Um, you have to sell for cheap. You have to sell for cheaper than that. Yeah, we're gonna have to probably put this one. I say we probably get twenty, twenty-five dollars for it. Well, and the only reason why I say that is because you can buy an actual Keurig now for about. Yeah, they're not that expensive. Especially yeah. this one is basic. This yeah. is this is as basic as you can get. Okay, so I'm gonna say. It's probably the slowest Keurig maker ever. You think so? Yeah. Are they slow? Okay, so we got one at work. Uh huh. And it's not a Keurig. And you know, I'm used to my Keurig. You know, you push the button, and then like two seconds later, you got hot, co hot coffee. Mm -hmm. When I tell you, I gotta wait ten minutes for the water. To, it's a generic one that we. Have. Oh, okay. So the one we got there is generic. It's kind of like that. Yeah. It's um. It take like 10 minutes for it. Okay, first you gotta pour the water in. <laughs> and then you gotta suck the water down and then you gotta wait for the water to heat. 10 minutes, no lie. Then it finally just, I mean, it's, it works for, but if you like in a hurry. Which I mean, like, need my coffee quick. Like how I'm always, I'm always in a hurry because <laughs> I can't get anywhere on time. So <laughs> I'm always running behind. So I'm like, I need to stay in a hurry up. Uh -huh. <laughs> and it be going slow. 
I bet you it's the slowest thing ever. Mm -mm. We'll see. $20. That's what I'm We'll going do with. 20 20 25 is yeah. what I'm thinking. Yeah. Oh, it's me. April, you next. We got this. I, so you should know what that is because you looked it up. Uh, QYL Ignition Coil. It's an eight pack. That's what it looked like. I don't know what it do, but it's eight of them. And they are selling online for $76, $86. I can't tell if that's a seven or eight. So between seven and eight dollars. And these are actually, I've already listed this so I know, but these are actually brand new. Um, yeah. I don't even know what it is. Oh yeah, look They're at this. So if you got a car, it's got eight cylinders. Oh, all oh, cylinders. Yeah, oh. you have eight, eight of these. Oh, it's you stick them down there and, and this is oh, yeah, and it's like, cool. I'm sure they're expensive. Yeah, so they're, I mean, they're all brand new. They're all in here. Um, not really nothing, anything to test, which is awesome because I hate right. testing stuff. Right. <laughs> it's not my cup of tea. All right, all next right. item. This is another automotive part. This is a Bendix um, Fleet Metlock. These are police brakes. So it breaks I, for a police car. So I looked at it and I said, ooh, them look like brakes. Can you mm. believe I actually knew what something looked like? You knew it. <laughs> uh, I don't know if these are the front or the rear, but the front and the rear go for about the same price. They're going for about $50, uh, $58. Ain't really nothing to see. It's just a box yeah. of brakes. brake pads. Um, they're, of course, they're brand new. They've never, never been used. It's not like they're used pads. Um, and then they've got the uh, clips and all the stuff that goes along with them. I used to change brakes. I've not changed brakes in so long. I don't know how to change brakes. <laughs> I know what they look like. That's I, I, I'll change them because I ain't paying no three hundred dollars to get no brakes changed. It's crazy. That they only fifty dollars because the brakes for the SS five hundred dollars just for just for the brakes itself. Yeah, see, those are Brembo Brembo brakes or whatever. They like high performance brakes. I just want you to put the bare basic. And they I just like, want just the regular. I just want to stop. And they're, like, <laughs> and they're like, no, you gotta put these good brakes. On uh huh. Them. And then they squeak those Brembo uh, brakes. I used to have they, those on my Camaro, and they mm -hmm. squeak bad. Yeah, they put them five hundred dollars. I was like, how much? Mm -mm. So next, what is that? This, it's a brown box. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I don't know what that is. This is a. I think that's a work set. I mean, like a, a tool set. It's something. It's one hundred forty-five dollars. Oh no, it ain't. <gasps> When, okay, so let me tell y'all a quick story about this before we, I know I keep telling a lot of stories, yeah. but this, had, we're, this is the video, we're gonna tell stories. Um, so I was, <laughs> I went to the bin store, I didn't check anything. I didn't check any sold comps when I went to the bin store, when I went to the uh, to the Gimme 5 mm -hmm. and to the uh, North Georgia Liquidations. Mm -hmm. I did. You just got it in. I just got it and then when I got in the car, I said, well, let me check the sold comps. I just looked at the items mm -hmm. because there was a lot of people and I was just trying to get in and out. and. Um, I didn't really have a place to sit down and check this whole comps. Right. So when I got out to the car, I went to go to the barbecue joint, yeah. which was buddies. buddies up there. Mm -hmm. While I'm sitting in the, the drive-thru, I said, let me pull out one of these items and check it. So this is the first thing I pulled out. This is what it is, so you guys can see it. It's like for the rich folks. It's a pot, um, it's a, uh, it's a pot filler. Pot filler, faucet. It goes over your stove. Oh, I need one of these. Huh? <laughs> I'm yeah. I ain't paying $145. No. But. $145. Stainless steel. Brand new. There's everything's here. Everything's included. Awesome pickup for yep. $5. Yep. I mean, this is this is, this is top, top quality. I don't remember exactly which one, which place I got this from, but I know it was either $5 or it was $5. It had to be $5 because yeah. that's where I got it from, the $5 place. So. So that's what this is. $145 on eBay. And I think I listed that already. I'm not sure. Okay. I know I got this from Gimme Five. So what this is? Okay, I'm gonna pull this out. Okay, you got yeah. This is. I saw the case. It was a nice case. Yeah. Uh, and it was already open when I got it. Every time I see one of these transparency barcodes. You will go ahead. And... Yeah. So what this is is a, it's a drum. It's got the little thing right here. Yeah. And it's like a like I'm. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's like a meditation drum or if it was a drum that you actually like, you know, I don't know. I'm about to throw it. You ain't ready to get those out. But the, each one of them has like a different, I don't know, sound. So like this is, this is a seven sharp, this is a five.
good. Not good. No, bye. Uh, so anyway, I saw this. I thought it was pretty cool. Um, it's actually going for about sixty-eight dollars online. Yeah. Um, Somebody. Some. Now they have some of these April. The actual ones from like the, I don't know. There must be an actual like brand yeah. of this gun. Gun high. Oh, I didn't even show it. I just started banging on it. Just start playing. <laughs> that's, that's what. what it like. That's what it looks like. It's just like a. I don't know. It's a drone. Anyway, they go for like $350. That's crazy. Yeah, but this one, I'm okay with 68 Yeah, but we don't pay $5. We don't pay 5 for it. Um, and then it comes in this great box that we're just going to seal up and then we can ship right. it off just like that. Yep. <laughs> um, yeah, I thought that was a pretty cool little, pretty cool little pickup right there. Yeah. All right, next item. I'm pulling stuff up. Okay, we have an Afrog desk light. A what? Afrog. That's what it's saying, isn't it? That's what it's saying. <laughs> a frog. Uh-huh. Uh, actually, what this is, is a desk light, and then you can also set your cell phone down, and it has like a key charger. Okay, so seriously. What? I feel like I, I might need it. I use it. I got one. I got yeah. one upstairs I bought from Walmart for like $40. Yeah. Um, and this one is actually going for $35 online. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. But if you want to keep it, keep it. <laughs> Might need that. I don't know. Jay in the group said that they don't keep nothing. He said, "Let's mess with his money." It, 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 <laughs> it, it does, but sometimes I just feel. Sometimes you just feel like you just need it. Uh huh. I mean, in the grand scheme of things, we got all this other stuff. I know. So, you know. All right. So here we have a Winbridge original voice amplifier. I'm pretty sure I got that from the new Ben store. Twenty five dollars. Yeah, twenty five. So they had something that was like higher priced, but that month they were going for 25 and they actually had a, quite a bit of sold comps. All right, the next thing, every time I see Philips Hue, I always grab it because they're expensive. And I like Philips, it's a good brand. Mm -hmm. So this is a Philips Hue white and color um, LED strip. This is just like an extension one and it's 40 inches in length. And um, when you open it up, it's in here. Hmm. So it's just like an extension. Um, I don't know, it's just like an extension piece. If you have like the one already, you just plug yeah. this one in and then it just It just makes it, it yeah. Um, so this is going for $22. Okay. Well, this little bit of box set right there shipped first class, so it's gonna be cheap. Three, mm -hmm, two or three dollars to ship. Mm -hmm. All right, here we have, yep, mm -hmm. mm. on the ground. This is a Howard Light Sync Radio Digital AM FM Radio Earmuff. I mean, this thing, look at it. It's legit, I opened it up, and it's uh, the box kind of banged up a little bit, but it's yeah. new on the inside of it. No, let me just show you guys what this thing looks like. Look at it. <laughs> look, it's got the buttons on the side. Yeah. Oh. They're okay. Yeah. I don't know what they're for, sync either. radio. If y'all know what these sync radio things are for, let us know. It may just be for listening to the radio, but those know. are kind of heavy duty for, I mean, for radio. I mean, seriously. <laughs> it's got a, a barcode on it, too. Yeah. I'm trying to see where you put the... Uh, I thought I put, I put it right there next to the barcode. Did you? Mm -hmm. Oh, you did. <laughs> $55. You can't see it. So, $55. All right. The next thing is in a box. And, oh, I don't want to open it. This is factory sealed, and the reason I know it's factory sealed is because it's got one continuous piece of tape that goes all the way around, yeah. and it goes over the label. Yeah. So, I don't want to cut this open, but I may have to. Yeah. i probably cut the bottom open. That way I retain this, the yeah. bottom of it. Let's cut it. So, I mean, let's just do it. Why not? Yes, Why would we not do it now? I hate this because, you know, a lot of people say, that, you know, it goes from a... New item to open box item. Yeah, but they still sell. They still sell. People still buy them. So it's a little dusty, but it's brand new. Yeah. Um, I don't know what this is or what it's for. <laughs> it's a piece. It's a three-way valve is what it is. A Navian three-way valve. So that's what it looks like. I don't even know what that's. It's a bunch of stuff. It's a valve. Somebody I'm, buy it. I'm assuming it goes in the car or something. I don't know. It's made in Korea. That's the only thing I know for sure. Um, but it has sold comps on here for $64. So when okay. I saw this, I said, every time I see a three-way valve, I always pick them up because we've gotten a couple mm -hmm. three-way valves and, they and they're say, always over like $50. Yeah, and they said people buy them though. Bolo. And if they call it Bolo, be on the lookout. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I guess I could have told y'all what I- what Yeah, but it's holding up. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> so, 
Here's a purse. It's an Angel Barcelona. Barcelo. Angel. Of that's what this my is. So it's a little purse. That's what it looks like at the front of it. It's got the little strappy that goes. Yeah. That you can go. So these are selling for forty five dollars somewhere. So those did have some listed and sold comps. And I talked about that a little bit in the video yesterday. That sometimes you can look at stuff and it you'll see like a great price for something, but it have like a thousand of them. Yeah. Listed and yeah. one sold. Yeah. Don't pick that up. Yeah. I mean, unless you just want to have it for a long time. It's yeah. going to sell it probably eventually, but it's just going to take a long time for it to sell. Right. Um, so those actually had more sold comps than they had listed. Okay. So I figured, you know, it, pr it should it's sell a, pretty quick, yeah, I, would, I would say. Yeah. Plus it's brand new. Yeah. You know, it's not used. There was a lot of pre-owned ones on there. All right. This is a Mountain Dream soundbar bracket. Um, I actually did show y'all the sold comps for this um, live while we was... Why well, I was in the bins yesterday because uh, y'all saw me pick it out of the bins. This is going for about $35. They had them listed around $37, $33. So I priced it in the middle. $35. This is brand new. It is sealed on here. Um, so you shouldn't have to open it up or test it or yeah. look at it in any kind of way. Just, brand new. Yep. Next, we have a hammer activated. And that's not what this is. It says hammer activated. <laughs> This is a, what is this? I don't know. I think it's some kind of like maybe a brad nailer or something like that. It's something for when you're hammering in uh, stuff inside of like nails inside of walls. You put the nails on the end of it and then yeah. you bang on the end of that. And it, With your hammer. And it does it. Because it's hammer activated. It's hammer activated. But like if you had uh, um, normally to do a brad, have to nail in brads, you would need uh, a Air compressor and okay. the whole a gun and all this yeah. kind of stuff. I think that's what that is. Okay. I'm pretty sure. Yes, I don't know. Say for, for fastening sure. to concrete, masoner. Masoner. That right there. <laughs> or steel. Okay. So this is um, something. How much is this? That right there is actually thirty dollars. So it's like thirty, 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 or thirty-five dollars. Okay. So it's thirty-five dollars. All right, so, we got this other one. so I picked this up. This was at the, our, our go-to, which is Lakeside Treasure Hunt. Mm -hmm. And I saw this in the bins and I picked it up and I scanned it because it had a barcode. And um, when I saw the price, I heard it and snatched it up and I saw that one like right close to it. Yeah. So I heard it snatched it up too. Yeah. And at first I thought I had two of these. Yeah. And I was excited. But yeah. I mean, I'm okay with that. Yeah. But I did think that that was this whenever I got it. Yeah. Anyway, this is a uh, Ramset professional grade uh, fastening professional thing professional thing <laughs> it's a power actuated powder it's a powder actuated tool so it's actually it's like a, okay i think something like that anyway can you say that it's like a <laughs> you to edit it'll be bleeped out, out. i can't yeah. say that word um but this right here is going for 89 dollars. okay so pretty good pretty good all right so we have next is an Empower, M Empower. That's not what I meant. Empower wired computer headset, and we've actually sold a couple of these. I think I just listed some the other day. So these do pretty good. This is selling for how much is this one selling for? I think it's selling for twenty something dollars. I wrote it. I think right next to the. Can you see? Mm -mm. Maybe it's right 25. 25. Okay, so he wrote in red. <laughs> on red. How am I supposed to see that? I don't know where it's the red. $25. Okay. I'm getting this small one. Okay. All right, this is a eMeet uh, 1080p autofocus webcam. Um, we actually sold a bunch of these because mm -hmm. webcams are just hot because obviously everybody's at home webcaming. Yeah. Um, so this is $35. Um, it's brand new. We're just adding with our collection. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it's a... Uh, I don't know. It's just a webcam. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> this is probably selling for about $20. How yeah. much is it? Yeah. 35 35 okay. Yeah. All right. Next, we have this Creative Household Product Lichen. I didn't mean to get this. This was... So, you know, I said I didn't check any sold comps, but I saw that and I typed that brand in. They had some pretty good sold comps mm -hmm. for, and I didn't know what it was. It is a DIY hanging room divider. Yeah, this is what it looked like. Yeah. 
It's just like a room divider and it's got like a weird pattern on it. It's got a random keychain in them. We can sell that for about $20. Yeah. Um, it had kind of slow comps all over the place, but I sell it on $20 because I said yeah. I ain't going to $15. <laughs> Alright, this is, what is this? Oh, I can't open this. I'm gonna take it out of the box, but I'm not gonna open it because all the stuff will fall out of it. But this is actually a really nice tool set. Oh, okay, so that's the one you said we had a tool set. Yeah, so this is the tool set. I'm not gonna open it because it took me forever to get all the stuff back in here, but it's brand new. It's got a ton of tools. Actually, I'll put a picture of it okay. um, on the screen here. This is Small Household Mechanic brand. Okay. Um, We had another one mm -hmm. and we sold it. That's this is that's bigger than the last one we had. You yeah. know the other one we had? Mm-hmm. So this one was actually this one actually sold for fifty seven dollars. Okay. Um and they have a ton of soul comps for fifty around okay. the same price, fifty seven dollars. It's kinda heavy, so um they probably have to go in like a regional rate A or a regional rate B or a uh, flat rate box. Okay. Something like that. Here we have a Vic car automobile diagnostic expert. I don't know what it's gonna tell you, but it's gonna diagnose something. This is what it looked like. Um, Twenty-three dollars sold is what it's selling for. Okay. I don't know what it. That's what it looked like. All right. Speaking of, this had nothing to do with that. So these what? are some <laughs> uh, batteries. Love batteries. Yeah. So it's actually a two pack, and I already looked at the soul comps for these. Um, these aren't very expensive because they are not branded, mm -hmm. um, but they are 18 volt lithium ion, uh, six milliamp hour batteries. Um, and they're going for about $29 for the pair. Okay. So uh, hopefully somebody need these. It does have a brand on there, a brand name. It's, mm -hmm. it's like Power Mall or something like that. But a lot of these unbranded, branded ones. Uh, probably like half. Probably like $30, $40. Yeah, but they're a fraction of the cost of yeah. brand new, like right. Dewald or these are probably like Milwaukee based on the colors. Yeah. Um, you know, a lot of people opt to get these because they're a lot cheaper, right. you know, to get. They do the same thing. Mm -hmm. okay. Allegedly. Allegedly. All right, so next we have an outdoor light fixture wall mount, bulk not included. You have to make those statements so other people. Oh, well, yeah, they'd be mad. So this is what it looked like. Somebody on, in the group was talking about, they posted a picture of a, a cell phone case and they said, is the iPhone not included? And it was like listed for $15. Yeah. And they're like, uh, no, it's not included. Like, <laughs> are, you are you trying to test my patience? Are you trying to trigger me right yeah. now? Yeah, I don't understand what's happening. Do you tell me how much it costs? No, uh-uh, because oh. I am so small. Uh-uh. $50. <laughs> All right, y'all, we got two more items. Ugh. We didn't save the best for last, I can tell you that right now. Right. <laughs> this is a Kitchen Dale bamboo knife block. We actually have one of these. It's not the same exact one, but it's a universal, um, it's the same brand, but it's a universal right. one. Um, <clears throat> so, $35, not too like crazy yeah. anything, but no. I don't know, somebody buy it. It's a, actually a really nice uh, knife block. All right, last, not least, we have a, uh, this is a keyboard. Yeah, jelly comb. Jelly comb keyboard. That's it, that's what it looked like. It comes with the mouse too, look like. Mm -hmm. So mouse uh, keyboard combo, which is selling for $35. Look, I found it. Good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we've already calculated everything. Um, I think we had a total of 31 items. And the average cost was about six dollars fifty cent or six fifty, yeah. And because we some some of the being stores was five dollars, some of the being stores was eight dollars, so we kind of average it out based right. on how many items we got. Oh, there was also one item that we sold that is not in here that I need to add into. What is it? And it was this right here. It was a, a 3D one of those wooden 3D pew pews. Right. You know what I'm talking about? Got it. Yeah. So. Uh, Y'all saw that on yesterday's video hey, and I how much we, we sold had, it for. Oh, I didn't know we had another one. I uh, guess because we... Because it's so... so yeah. Those those are bolos. If you see yeah. those 3D, these right here, the 3D yeah. printing... The 3D printing. The 3D uh, wooden, like, things that you can put together. Yeah, get those. They sell every single time. Yeah. Quick. Um, so we sold that. And I think... I don't know how much we sold it for, but I added yeah. up 
It's gonna be added on to this amount that I'm about to give you right now. Right. So, without further ado. $1,429. It's probably around $1,500 extra right. once you count in the other lamp that we sold or the, the, the uh, terrarium yeah, the ter thing yeah. and the uh, the and wooden the, thing. Yeah. So I'm just going to say $1,500. Um, probably after shipping the fees, probably around $1,300 yeah. or something like that. I think it was a pretty good thing. Yeah, considering uh, thing. we only spent roughly $200 on yep. everything. So. so if you have a bin store, I don't know what you're waiting on. Yeah. Get over there. Get to sourcing. Get to binning. Mm -hmm. Get the get the binning. You could actually one probably a person could probably go and source and make mystery boxes out of these. Yeah. The bin store. I mean, it would take a lot of work, and you yeah. wouldn't be able to make a lot of them. Mm -hmm. um, but you could probably do that. You could probably make a bin uh, a mystery box out yeah. of this stuff. I don't know how much you would profit. You would profit more, obviously, listening to stuff. Yeah. Um, but you could do something like that to kind of help people. Yeah. You know, that's like a business idea. Yeah. I wouldn't do it because it would take it's extremely too much, too too much, much time. Yeah. I mean, you have to go source all this stuff. Yeah. Um, but yeah. So if you like these types of videos, please like, share, and subscribe. Really appreciate it. Also hit that bell icon so you get notifications whenever we release new videos. This week, we will have uh, another unboxing. We're going to have an 88 lots. Mm -hmm. uh, the last kitchen box is going to be unboxed. They'll probably come out around Friday-ish um, or something like that. And then I'm going to the bin store again. I may fly up to Knoxville. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. I'll probably get y'all get another Ben store video next week, I'm sure. And then maybe we'll yeah. get another paddle or something next week. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Yeah. <laughs> um, stay awesome, stay beautiful, and more importantly, stay humble. Right. You like that? That's a, like That's a cool little ending. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds like a merch idea. We should make some merch off of that. Okay. <laughs> y'all have a good night. Peace. Mm -hmm.